that the regular season for 2016 is done and dusted. It finished out here at Pepper Stadium a little bit earlier when Penrith beat Manly 36-6. And in the last 36 hours of that regular season, I think we saw the best tackle of the year so far. It is the last Barbers with it. The best pass of the year so far. And all the pass from Leilua was spectacular. And the best wedgie. So still going. But you're right. Determined to rip the cord. Meanwhile, uh, this little incident at the end of Melbourne's minor premiership winning uh, success against Cronulla on Saturday night is set to earn a couple of Storm players a rebuke from coach Craig Bellamy. That's not what we're about, and um, you know I don't like to see those things in the game. I think it shows a lack, lack of respect <coughs> for the opposition. Um, so yeah, I'll, whoever those guys were, I'll, I'll, I'll be having a chat to them. And Penrith's victory means uh, that they get a home advantage in the first week of the finals. And for some reason, they're going to use that home advantage at Allianz Stadium, even though it's further away than ANZ Stadium from here at the foot of the mountains. Now, that may be because ANZ Stadium is also the home of their opponents, Canterbury. However, Penrith coach Anthony Griffin said he played no part in the decision. Uh, this morning that the NRL uh, won't allow uh, a playoff here and that Allianz was um, our only option, so. Finally, I'll leave you with this summation of West Tigers' performance in their 52-10 defeat to Canberra from their prop, Aaron Wood. It's pretty shit, mate. There's not much else to sum it up that way, so... Yeah, it sucks, man. Don't forget to download the White Life Fever podcast on iTunes and like League HQ on Facebook and Twitter. See you in the finals.